For all things Halloween, this is Hauntformer, and welcome, yes, back to another Spirit Halloween sneak peek video. The sneak peeks are definitely ramping up in terms of quantity, and I would argue quality too. We're getting some really cool characters coming out. Eddie and Sam are the most recent of the bunch, and it seems to be the most popular in terms of fan favorites. I've been leaving polls and stuff on my community page, which check that out if you haven't before. But long story short, I am back with another Spirit Halloween sneak peek, kind of one that slipped under the radar, but I wanted to talk about it because Spirit has added it to their website at this time, and perhaps by the time I upload this, they might have put it on YouTube as well. And that is the brand new Arctic Dragon animatronic. So, if you didn't know, dragons and medieval-type Halloween-themed decorations are growing in popularity, and if you don't know the catalyst and the reason why, it's pretty obvious. It is because of the television show Game of Thrones, which I'm not a fan of. I haven't watched any episodes of Game of Thrones. I know it's some big phenomena, but I've never gotten into that kind of stuff. I'm not big into medieval things, so dragons aren't really a big appeal to me. But I can appreciate the historical uh, myths of dragons and beasts that lived long ago. I think it's really cool stuff. And dragons are getting into the spotlight more in terms of Halloween decorations. Uh, last year we saw the Winter Dragon, which was kind of this really big dragon that sold for 500 bucks. And now we're getting a slightly shorter dragon, still pretty large at 6.4 feet. The Winter Dragon was 7 feet, and this is now the Arctic Dragon, not the Winter Dragon, but they both have that kind of uh, winterish name to them, which I'm assuming is also reminiscent of Game of Thrones, too. So, this dragon stands at 6.4 feet, like I mentioned. He has more of a lighter color scheme in the grays and in the whites rather than in a darker color scheme. Which, by the way, if you're looking for a darker dragon, Grandin Road actually has a six foot, uh, it's called like the Dark Knight Dragon, but it's $500 and it's six feet, so they really up the price there. But regardless, this dragon has a lighter color scheme. He makes some pretty creepy growling noises as his head moves back and forth. He can shoot fog out of his mouth. And I think he looks rather cool. I actually like these new dragon designs a little bit more than the winter dragon. Just because I feel like they're a little more slender and that makes them creepier for some reason. Instead of this giant beastly thing, it's a little more of a slender dragon which i like um but i'm i've never been in the market for dragon stuff i'm really not a big fan of that that kind of stuff uh that and usually witches i don't gravitate towards in terms of halloween decorations not that i don't think they're cool i've just haven't been in the market but there are some witches that have stood out to me but dragons not really not really but I do think a lot of people will be interested in this one because of the price of $350. Seems expensive, but if you were someone who wanted those more expensive dragon animatronics, this one's going to be a lot more uh, satisfying for your wallet and for your budget. And with a coupon, you can get him down to a little bit under $300, which I think is a pretty fair price for the size, for the wings, for everything that he does. And I think that's all really cool. I haven't checked the site to see if he's online only or not. I could see some situations involving having this in the store where he's a little too tall uh, to fit in the stores, but hopefully we will see a dragon in stores because they are really cool and interesting characters. And speaking of in stores, this video was also, like many others we've seen thus far, shot on a boat. Which, I don't know what you want to take away there. Again, the videos don't always equal themes, but that is a possibility yet again. So, it should be interesting to see uh, if they plan on releasing more stuff in this dragon theme, or if they're going to move on to different stuff. I personally think... Probably the best sneak peek so far was Sam, just because he seemed to be a fan favorite and something that me and many other people wanted for a long time. But I can respect the Arctic Dragon for being a very unique creature. Let me know, of course, your thoughts in the comments below. And remember, as always, for all things Halloween.
this is Hauntformer. Hauntformer.